everybody and welcome back to my channel and on this channel I speak about fragrances so if this is something you're interested in please subscribe and today I wanted to discuss a new brand that I discovered for myself because they recently launched at Sephora and they also have a discovery set so I decided to give it a chance and today I want to speak about the my favorites from this brand and the brand is called Brown Girl Jane and all the scents from the brand kind of picked my interest because the notes were uh, very nice and it seemed like they're gonna be very playful, nice and easy going fragrances and they were and I would like to start with my favorite fragrance and this fragrance is Carnival this is the most recent scent that they came up with and this is like a perfect scent for the summer it opens up with a blast of creamy mango it's almost like it's candied mango so in the opening I can definitely smell mango, jasmine and uh, with the touch of agave that gives this fragrance a very candy-like type of sweetness it smells like you walked in into a candy store and they had like candied mangoes all over the place it's very very like candy like mango so i really love it it's creamy and also fluffy so uh, i really love it it uh, adds it makes this fragrance very playful and kind of flirty which is perfect for the summer and as it starts to dry down i smell amber vanilla but mango is still in there it's just um, slightly more toned down so i think this is a really good scent for the summer if you want something very easy going very playful and simple you know it's not nothing groundbreaking nothing like crazy sophisticated but it's really nice and uh, flirty so if this is something that you're into give it a chance and the next fragrance that i really liked was casablanca and i think this is a bestseller from this uh, from the brand and you know it's understandable why because it's a very easy to like type of fragrance uh, it is also really similar to something very popular so I'll speak about it uh, in a second so it opens up with marshmallow, cardamom and touch of suede so it's like a very cozy type of scent in the opening and I really love the note of marshmallows so I really really love the opening and it was very promising for me I thought I'm gonna love this fragrance but unfortunately as it started to dry down it reminded me of black opium like it smells almost identical in the dry down so uh, if you already have black opium I think this one is going to be slightly redundant unless you're a lover of black opium and you collect all of their scents and in this case try Casablanca because it's really similar but the opening is different and the next scent is Dusk and this fragrance, as soon as I sprayed it, I was like, smells like something else. It smells like something I used to wear like three, four years ago. And honestly, I still cannot uh, like remind myself of what it was. And it drives me absolutely nuts. Like it's, it smells just so familiar, but I can't pinpoint what it smells like. So just in case you smelled dusk before and you know what it's similar to, then please write down in the comments because I really, really want to know. So I really like the scent because it's very comforting and cozy. It's uh, your skin but better type of scent. It opens up with coconut and almonds and slightly like tonic base. I can't really smell the florals that are indicated in the pyramid. I think it's it, it has uh, jasmine, vanilla orchid and freesia. And I can't really smell it but I just can smell something really clean. Uh, almondy and uh, lactonic like I just said I don't really smell the florals maybe some people will be able to but I wasn't able to and uh, so this is a very your skin but better type of scent it's very like I said cozy comforting and easy to like so I think this one gonna be popular if more people try it I also think that the name is very suiting for this fragrance because it almost has this kind of like melancholic type of mood you know it's just uh, getting dark and uh, it's like the nature is calm you know the sun is setting so it's very comforting and melancholic type of scent and if this is something that you're into which I am then you should try this one and the last fragrance that I wanted to discuss is dawn which is the opposite of dusk so, so dawn smells like you know the sun rising 
freshness in the air something uh, slightly sweet you know and watery also i think they perfectly captured the essence of this time of day so to my nose it smells creamy fruity vanillic and a little bit aquatic it starts off pretty fruity with raspberry and cassis and stays that way for uh, like around 10 to 15 minutes i would say and after that it dries down to pretty ambery vanilla so i can't really smell other notes that are uh, in the pyramid but i definitely smell an ambery vanilla in the dry down and it's also like a slightly aquatic vanilla so maybe it's coming from cassis or water lily uh, yeah, it's really nice and it does remind me, you know, of the morning uh, time when everything is waking up, when everything is still fresh and, you know, there is some kind of like wetness in the air. Uh, so I think that if you like fruity fragrances and if you like vanilla, then this one is going to be easy to like and super easy to wear. So thank you so much guys for watching this video. In this video I spoke about my favorite fragrances from the brand Brown Girl Jane and the fragrances were Carnival, Casablanca, Dusk and Dawn and I really hope that this, this video was helpful for you and that you are gonna try the fragrances and find something that you like. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!